Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Grayson's doing somersaults and borders. <laughs> Eating some yogurt. <laughs> Porter, no, no, put it on the plate. I'm so nervous he's going to just spill it all over the carpet. Ah. <laughs> so anyway, I'm recording because it's the morning. Obviously, we're still in our jammies. We're about to get dressed. And why is today a big day, Gray? Yes, Mommy. What are we doing today? We're going to play my soccer. You're going to play soccer. So today is Grayson's first game of his second year of soccer. And we're so excited to watch him play, huh? Are you going to be a soccer rocker? Yes. Yeah, are you going to kick the ball? Yes. Are you going to score the goals? <laughs> yeah. We're going to pass the ball to our friends. Yeah. So I'm very curious to see how this is going to go. Uh, if you've seen my past vlogs in the first... So let me start at the beginning. How it works here is you pay for a year of soccer. They do a season in the fall and a season in the spring. And each season is like... I don't know, six or seven weeks. It's it's very minimal. And so last year, we did the first season in the fall. And Gray was like, not into it. He would like, not stay on the field. It was very hard. Then uh, we came back in the spring and he was a lot better. He would stay out on the field a lot more. Still was having issues with different things, but it was a lot better. So now it's another six months later, because basically each season is like six months. And uh, so I'm very hopeful that Gray will do good um, this year, but we will see. So I went and picked up his uniform. It's actually the exact same uniform as last year, which why we couldn't have just kept that old uniform, I don't know. We had to pay for a new one. Uniform. Is that your yeah. uniform? And, and Porter wants to read a Christmas book. Okay, Porter. So yeah, we got his uh, uniform. They're sponsored by Tim Hortons. I think if he wears it and goes to Tim Hortons, he gets like free Timbits or something. I really don't know. But uh, we're going to get him dressed. He is so excited. I think um, Aunt Allison and Uncle Garrett and Aunt Kelly are going to come watch you play. Yogurt. Yogurt. It's on your plate. can play with me. Well, she's going to watch you play. She can't play soccer because she's too big, right? Just you play soccer. And we're all going to cheer you on. Yeah, I'll help you get dressed. So last year, Grayson's games were always on Saturdays at like 9 in the morning. This year, since he's like, they just separate it by age. So last year he was with the 3-year-olds. This year he's with the 4-year-olds. And so I think that is it. Or maybe he was with the 4-year-olds last year and he's with the 5-year-olds this year. I don't really, I don't know how they do that. But anyway, he is, say cheese. Say cheese. Wait, I'm vlogging. I'm vlogging. Porter wants the camera. Oh boy. Porter's having a meltdown because I won't give him the phone. Um, so this year, Grayson's games are at 11. So it's a little later in the morning, which is kind of nicer because we can kind of take our time in the morning. So we'll see how this goes. I think Porter's going to be a little jealous that he doesn't get to play soccer. But next year, Porter will play soccer. But this year, um, it's about Mr. Grayson. So we're going to get him ready, and we'll see how it goes. So I'll definitely vlog a little bit for you guys. Um, i got to make the letter board. we got to do some first day pictures and lots to do before he does his game. So here we go. Okay, we are doing pictures for Gray Gray. Soccer, year number two. We did the letter board, we got the soccer ball, Porter really wants the ball, <laughs> and we are ready for our soccer game. My sisters are on their way, they're going to come with Yay. us, and we are going to have you. some fun today, aren't we? Oh boy. Go, Gray! Porter. <laughs> 
<laughs> He's gonna go scoring in that goal. <laughs> Today. Does anybody know what colors are on a, on a traffic light? Red? Red? <laughs> Very soccer game. And then through the next one. Okay, lay down. And then through the next one. <laughs> okay, between the two guns. Good job, between the two oh, cones. Oh, the Good job. Oh, Alright, you're going to go down. through all four cones and then you're going to blast and it in the goal. Oh, wow. Go, go Gray! Oh, sit down. Stand up. And sit down. Go Gray! Yeah. Good job. Blast it in the goal. Go kick it in the goal. Woohoo! <laughs> Walking. <sighs> Racing, go get it. <laughs> He's just standing. Go, Grayson. Hey, all. So we are back from the soccer game. I have my Cincinnati um, shirt and sweatshirt on. I don't know if you can see it. Um, but I just wanted to close out this vlog and talk about the soccer game. So obviously you saw Grayson playing soccer. He did really, really well. He stayed out the whole time. He had his own little cheering section. Both my sisters came and cheered him on. Um, and he did really, really well. So this year, I don't know if I've explained it, but this year it's a little different. It's still only 45 minutes, just one day a week on Saturdays. But they've structured it a little different for his age group. So the first 30 minutes they do practices and just little games of like warm up. So they'll like try to knock over the cones or like work on passing to their teammate or um, to practice big kicks or dribbling the ball like up and down the field or whatever. Then the last 15 minutes, they actually play a different team. Usually it's the team that's in the field like right next to them. Like they have fields like from letters A all the way down to like L. So they have tons of teams of these little kids playing. And then whoever is in the field right next to them or right behind them, that's the team that they play for the last 15 minutes. And I think it's just to try to get them like some experience, like playing a different team and like making it a little more real. So that was kind of fun to see like the different setup. Um, what we're realizing is Gray is really good at the practice and the warm-ups and the drills. He, he's been doing really good at that. Um, but when it comes to the scrimmage, he is definitely not the star. He just isn't very um, forceful. He likes to stay back. All the kids will be like trying to get the ball and he'll just be in the back, just cheering on the team. Um, I mean, he'll run and keep up, but like he's not the one to like push other people out of the way and like kick the ball himself. So I think I could count on one hand how many times he actually touched the ball during the scrimmage, but it was still really cute to see. He didn't score any goals. Um, so we're going to work on that. That's good goals to work on, but it was so cute. It's still so cute to see like four and five year olds play soccer because <laughs> um, they still like don't know what they're doing. And um, it's fun to see other kids on other teams and like kind of compare. They're all at the same level. Some kids are really good and some kids are like, why am I here? <laughs> or just like having a bad day and don't want to do anything. So it was fun. Um, it was super nice because with our new house, we're actually walkable distance to the soccer fields now. Last year we had to drive and park in the crazy parking lot. They have the tiniest parking lot at this soccer place. Um, and so it was always a struggle to find parking. Now we don't have to do that, we just walk. We put the kids in the wagon and walk. It's about a little over 15 minutes to the soccer field. So it's really not that bad. So um, yeah, we walked there and back. It was a beautiful day. It's not cold yet because it's September. So um, anyway, it was great. We had a fun time. Now we're gonna cheer on our Cincinnati team. And um, Gray actually has next weekend off because it's Labor Day weekend. So they do one game and then 
they pause for a week, which is always so weird. Like, why wouldn't they just wait till after? And then he'll have a game every Saturday until right before Halloween. So I'm sure I will vlog as the season goes on. Um, I think it's like six or seven weeks or eight weeks maybe. And then we'll break at Halloween and then he'll do spring season. He's already signed up. He'll have the same team and coach and everything. He'll do spring season in like March or April for another like eight weeks. So it's good. Um, it's a little stressful getting the kids ready. Porter, as you saw in that one clip, he wanted to play so bad. We had to bring a separate ball for him and he wanted to kick the ball into the goal. He kept going, running out onto the field, which thankfully like it's very like low maintenance. Like the kids don't care if like siblings come on the field, but Porter wanted to play so bad. So next year he will get to play soccer, which just blows my mind because I still think of him as so little. But anyway, I'm rambling. Um, I just wanted to close out this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Let me know, are your kids in any sports? Are there any sports I should be um, looking to put Grayson into? Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.